Ryan from Politol.com, and tonight I'm going to show you how you can get Age of Wonders 2 for your Mac. First, this is Politol.com. We got all kinds of cool stuff, lots of games. There are over 700 Mac ports here, and tonight I'm going to focus on the specific port, which is Age of Wonders 2. Uh, to get to the game page, you can either go to the game ports plus Mac games link to the right or to the Mac Game Ports uh, tab up here, and there will be a blog post later where you can get to the game page. Uh, this is an RPG game, so you're going to go in here, and it'll be right under Age of Wonders 1. Uh, once you click on the game page, you're going to click the Download tab and uh, download the wrapper. Um, and you should get this file. 8.1.2.7-zip. Double-click it uh, and extract it with the archiver of your uh, choice. And you should get the Age of Wonders 2 file here. Once you've done that, um, if you haven't bought the game yet, you can go get it from goodoldgames.com. GOG.com. Whoopsies. There we go. And uh, look up Age of Wonders 2. Uh, I already own it, so I can just re-download it here. Uh, if you don't own it yet, you can just buy it. It's uh, $10. And uh, once you've downloaded it, you should get the uh, Age of Wonders 2 setup.exe file. Once you've got those two things, double click the wrapper, click install Windows software, uh, choose setup executable, navigate to the .exe that you downloaded from Google Games, and there we go. Skip. Yep. This shouldn't take that long for most people. It's not that big of a file. Alright, once this installation is complete, don't click launch, click the exit installer button. And then set the setup file, or the exit file to Age of Wonders uh, AOW2.exe. Then click quit, and you're going to double click the application. Oopsies, hold on a second. Double click it now. Hold on. Okay, so let's try this again. Uh, the only reason that I use X Quartz is because this computer doesn't use X11 very well. But for the rest of you, it should be uh, just fine in regular X11. Now, 
I've tested this game for about an hour or so, and it works just fine. So I'm not going to show any gameplay. But uh, for you, it should work just fine. I've tested this on my Intel, and uh, it should work just fine for ATI and NVIDIA users too. Um, anyway, thanks for watching, and I hope to see you on volatile.com.